the tractor sat here long enough that it's covered in vines. You're gonna have to stab that pan. Well, I ended up, I messed up again, and I left the key switch on, on the tractor. So that when you kill this diesel tractor, it actually has a lever that you kill it. And so I always forget to turn the key switch off, and then it drains the battery down. And it's been sitting here for a couple months, so the battery is completely drained. And uh, I've got a truck, I've got a truck running, hooked up to it, it still won't start. So I went ahead, I've got a battery charger on here as well. I've got it in boost and it's hooked to the battery so I'm charging it from both the vehicle and the battery charger trying to make this go as quick as possible. Well that's not exactly how I wanted our day to start out. Seems like every time I try to do something there's always a problem. So today we're going to be messing with Rebecca's billy goats today. Yeah they have like a mountain of hay. Wasted hay. Yeah. Wasted hay. All around their hay feeder. It's it's a it's huge so yeah it's actually built up so much that um the hay is actually at ground level now so they're eat, like eating out of the top of it so yeah. um so the plan is we wanted to use the tractors to haul off all the old hay use that dump wagon that we just got and then of course i left the tractor dead i left the key on the tractor's dead so uh it's slowing us down so you guys can see that this, I'm almost touching the roof with my head. <laughs> There's that much hay wasted from these billy goats. And uh, the hay feeder is almost completely buried. So first thing we got to do is we got to get the billy goats in their pen. Don't chew on me. <laughs> We're going to get them in their, like their pasture area and, and, and pinned into there. And then we got to move all this stuff out of here and start getting this hay out of the way and see if we can get it in that trailer. All right, so we were using this old water tank as a shelter. Um, we'd cut a door out, and Luke <laughs> likes to jump on top of it. So I came out here one day to bring him hay, and it, they had collapsed it. So I've been picking up the pieces as they've been tearing it apart, throwing them away, but it's in pretty rough shape. <laughs> yeah, we may be able to clean this up or do something with it. I'm thinking maybe if we cut the top of it off, and then maybe we could flip it over. <laughs> and uh, make the bottom the roof. Maybe they could still use it as a shelter. What do you think? Yeah, as long as they don't jump on it and collapse it more. I think, I think the bottom is actually... Solid. I think it's more solid. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and uh, we could try that. When we put this all back together, maybe we can do something with this and, and salvage something out of it, or we're just gonna have to cut it up and throw it away. Oh, I think it's pretty brittle. Uh, you may not be able to salvage anything out of it. That's up to my knee in hay. It's crazy. Bunch of stink bugs under here. Oh, oh nice. <laughs> and there goes Rebecca. <laughs> She's not big on mice. Oh, there goes another one. You're not gonna be able to make it through the day if there's gonna be mice <laughs> running out. I knew they were in there, I figured. <laughs> Yeah, you're not gonna make it. It's gonna be like torture. It's got, actually, it's just a rounded bottom. I don't think the bottom is anything different. So, oh, it's gonna bust. Hey, there we got it. I'm a little bit scared now. I'm sorry, what? Scared. You scared of my, mice? I stirred up the mice. I'm standing right where they were. Oh, 
Oh. Come on. Here they come. All right, we got them inside here. Now we just got to pin them in. I bought this battery last year. Man, I may have ruined it already. I've discharged this thing probably at least, oh, five times probably. I keep doing this to myself. You'd think I'd learn. Oh, it's close. Tell me if I start hitting you with stuff. Okay. <laughs> uh, sticks to the fork pretty good. I haven't seen any more mice yet. That's good. Rebecca told me not to throw any mice at her. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Just get stuck on there. So the last time we cleaned this thing out was actually last year. It's been a whole year and <laughs> we've let it build up. So this is a whole year's worth of wasted hay for these three goats. You can see that ends up being quite a bit. I'm wondering how many trailer fulls this will be. Oh uh, yeah, I'm, I'm thinking it'll be more than one. Yeah, I'm guessing three. <laughs> I'm gonna guess two, we'll see. We're gonna probably have to find something else. What? I said, I, I said this is getting packed to be too in. much work. It's packed in there. Yeah. I'd say we're gonna have to try to fit the. I think before we used the tractor forks and you got under it, yeah. it was lifting, loosening it up. Yeah, I might have to get the Alice year. Chalmers in here and see if we can break this up or pull it out. Yeah. I just wish I had a manure fork for the Alice. Maybe a future project. Yeah, it gets like caked in layers. Yeah. Look at that. Like uh, carpets. Yeah. Well, you're really getting into your work. Well, I'm trying to get as much on here as possible. <laughs> I'm klutzy though. Hopefully, yeah, you I don't may fall, fall off. off. Oh man. We're gonna try to move this hay feeder out of the way. And then I think we're gonna try to get the Alice Chalmers tractor in here with a set of forks. See if we can break up all this hay because it's pretty matted. Oh, there's no way we're moving that. I had a feeling. You may have to get it's the forks like, under it. It's like grown in there. Yeah, I think you're gonna have to get forks under it. Yeah, we'll try to lift it with the Alice.
been scooping with the pallet forks and we were getting like good solid rugs of, of old hay. Now it's all loose, it's fallen through the forks, so we're gonna take the forks off, scoop it with the bucket, hopefully that picks it up, and hopefully get this finished. All right, I think we got the goat pen cleaned out pretty good. So I'm gonna take the Alice Chalmers tractor and that first load that I dumped in front of the compost bin, I'm gonna take that tractor and I'm gonna try to push the hay in toward the compost bins to try to pack it up against there. And then we'll take this other dump trailer and we'll dump it again right in front of there and then we'll try to pack it in. And then that should be it for now with the moving the wasted hay. And then we'll come back here and we'll start straightening stuff up.
right, so we're all finished and the goats are screaming to get back in here. So we have to set the fence back up, plug it back in, and see what they think. Yeah, and I think that'll pretty much finish it up for today. So we did cut the top off of this, didn't we? And yeah. uh, it doesn't, it's pretty flimsy. Uh, the goats will probably end up getting on top of it and they'll probably break it. So we'll just have to wait and see what happens. If they break it again, we'll just end up throwing it away. But for right now, it still can act like a little house for the goats. Yeah. So what'd you think about the clean out today? This was a whole year, a whole year <laughs> worth of wasted g hay from the goats. It was rough. That's a, that's a workout. And it's like, I don't know, what time is it? Three o'clock, four o'clock? I don't know, I'm not even sure. Probably close to three o'clock. We so. haven't even ate today. Probably a good thing, because. Yeah, so that's about four hours yeah. out here cleaning this up. And uh, you can see why we put this one off. This one actually is not very easy to clean. And the only tractor that really fits in here is the Alice Chalmers. It'd be, I know a lot of people are gonna be like, why didn't you use your grapple on the mm -hmm. TYM tractor? And I wish and, we could. <laughs> yeah, with the cab, it's got the cab on the tractor. There's no way it'll fit underneath this carport. So we're forced to use the Alice Chalmer with some pallet forks, which doesn't work very well. No. So maybe one day I'll make some manure forks for it um, so that it'll pick up the hay better. But um, So what'd you think about when I busted the hay? When I brought the tractor in here for the first time and I broke it open, what'd you think about that? Um, well, I got a whiff of the most horrid smell I've ever smelled, and I'm a nurse, so that says a lot. <laughs> yeah, it just she said she said when I broke that up, it was like a wave of like ammonia or whatever all oh, just it was hit terrible. you. <laughs> so it's got pretty stinky. Like the very top of it's dry, but the very bottom gets very stinky mm -hmm. in there, sitting there for a year. So we're catching up, or at least we're trying to catch up on some of the chores that need to be done around here, some of the big chores. And this is probably one of the biggest ones we had to do. It's one of the most dreaded ones, for sure. Yeah, we've been mowing everywhere, trying to get everything mowed and get all the weeds slowly, trying to get all the weeds cut down. And uh, she cut my hair the other day. Yeah, so my hair's <laughs> cut now. I know in the last video, my hair was long from working all those long hours. And um, I know I had people asking me if I was trying to gr grow a mullet, <laughs> not on purpose. I wasn't trying to grow a mullet on purpose, but uh, just uh, never had the time to get my hair cut over the last couple months. But finally, finally Rebecca cut my hair the other day and looks a lot better. Yep. Well, I'm ready to get back to the house, cool down and eat. So we're gonna let the cat, the- The cats, we're gonna let the cats. <laughs> I was gonna say cows. <laughs> cows. <laughs> we're gonna let the goats. We're gonna let the goats back in here and uh, finish up and go back to the house. So yes. I think that's about it. Yeah, so we'll go ahead and string the fence up and call it a day. So thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you in the next one. <laughs> Do you want to keep that one? Huh? Sure. bunch of stink bugs in here. Oh, oh nice. <laughs> and there goes Rebecca. <laughs> She's not big on mice. <laughs>